to healthy tip number seven. Awesome. Of course. To today, We've lucky done this seven. seven times. We're <laughs> we're going to talk about um, what it is that we do in order to keep our immune system up over the holidays when you're bombarded with stress, when the temperature changes, you're eating really junky food. There's a lot of things that you can do to keep your immune system up. And what we prefer and what we really educate in our office is to actually get a chiropractic adjustment. So there's two different areas in your spine that actually activate nerves that go to the lymphatic system and to your immune system. Increase your immune system just like taking vitamin D increases your immune system It'll increase your immune system for up to 36 hours after an adjustment which will help you fight colds coughs flus Stress all of the things above so in our family instead of getting a flu shot We get what we call a flu adjustment so that our immune system stays really high so we don't get the flu So dr. Cal is going to take me through a adjustment and not just any adjustment this is for pregnant women because we're pregnant still. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and get her adjusted. Um, and this is also big, like if you have back pain or neck pain and things like that, is that when your when your body's in a stress or in a pain mode, it's a lot harder to handle stress and it also lowers the immune system. So it's it's if you if you don't have pain, we do it just simply to boost the immune system, but we also can help get rid of symptoms too, which is cool. Okay, so she's gonna lay face down. We have this cool pregnancy pillow here that actually allows her stomach to go in here um, and pregnant women love this thing because they actually get to lay face down again. Can you raise this up? Very good. Just a little bit. Okay. All right, so I'm going to walk you through what we do and it's a little bit different for everyone but for a pregnant patient this is our, our main focus. The okay, first thing I do is I like to check her leg length and many times this will tell me if her pelvic if her pelvis is, is on level which it is especially on this right side and this is going to sound loud, but it's not as, as hard as it actually is going to sound on here. But I'm going to work to unrotate her pelvis because it's rotating backwards on this right side and super tight, which when her pelvis rotates, it's going to take the ligaments that attach to the, ba to the um, uterus and it'll start to twist it and then cause the all kinds of issues with birth. So, well, I think I'm going to do this at least. Here we go. Good. How's that? Good. And then double check her legs. And good news is her legs are even now. Okay. And I just go through and I feel her spine. I can find the areas that aren't moving properly. One is right in here. Okay, take a deep breath in, breathe all that, and we do this the other way. No? Okay. Good. That's nice for And this is a huge area to boost the immune system as well. We're gonna do one more right here. Good. Okay. Now maybe you could then sit up. Good, and go ahead and lay on your back. Perfect. Okay, so the next thing I do, um, really with all patients, but this is very big for pregnant patients, is we want to check the IT bands, anything that can hold pet pelvic girdle together to make sure everything's loose. And if you see when I turn this leg, you see how this leg, can you see that, Cassie? Mm -hmm. This leg doesn't rotate in as much as this one does. And so that means her IT bands are super tight right here. We're just going to go ahead and release the IT bands. Perfect. And then we can recheck it. You can see everything moves like it's supposed to, which is really cool. Okay, the next thing I like to do is check her psoas muscle. You can see both your hands. And there's a muscle that attaches from your pelvis to your spine, it is your hip flexing muscle. But it can get very tight, especially during pregnancy. And I'm checking her. So you can come on this way, I'll show you what we're seeing here. So you see the difference in her hands? See how this one's shorter than this one? Mm -hmm. Okay. So we're going to release the psoas muscle. So we'll bend her knee. Now get in here. It's a little bit harder, obviously. She's got a baby in there. So we get in there and we just release this muscle. Okay, is that painful? It's so hard. Bend her. Okay, right. one more. Good. Straighten that knee. Come check her hands. Fingers together. Okay, come check her hands out again. And as you can see, her hands are nice and even. So that means that release. Okay, I'm going to do one last, one other thing here. Just a big hug. I'm going to release this part because it didn't go earlier. Okay. And then we're going to do the final part of the adjustment for her, which is her neck. And she has a lower area in her neck and then the top area of her neck. So we're going to be real light. Good, and then one more. Good. 
So which areas? Okay, so we did C5, which is the lower part of her neck. Those are the nerves that to her traps and to her, her shoulders. And then we did C1, which is the main nerve. This is the upper part of your neck. This is a huge immune system area, but there's a main nerve called the vagus nerve that goes to every area of the body. So when we adjust that, it allows your body to start to relax. Mm -hmm. There you go. And we're going to do one last thing. And this is something we do in our offices to make sure we're getting full range of motion in the spine and also getting a curve back in the neck. So we want to have a special curve in the neck. So we work to get this curve in the neck with the arthro stem. And this might look painful, but is that painful? No, it feels good. It actually feels amazing. People love it. Mm -hmm. Okay? So that's how we adjust. This is how I adjust my wife. And uh, ultimately, that boosts the uh, nervous system and the immune system, but it keeps her free, free of aches and, aches and pains, mm -hmm. and also makes sure that her body is healing at its maximum potential because her nervous system is doing what it needs to do. Okay, do you have anything else to add? Oh, last thing. So if you're someone out there that, um, whether you're pregnant or not, if you're someone out there that's never been adjusted, maybe you've never had your spine checked, or maybe you're dealing with a symptom, uh, like back pain, neck pain, headaches, numbness, tingling, the hands, those things, we have our links above on this uh, video. Feel free, go there, actually, Click on the link. The Queen City Health Center is where we're at right now. That's in South Park. And then um, the um, Premier Physical Medicine, which is physicalmedicinecharlotte.com, is in Matthews. So if you've never been checked, we're actually doing a special throughout this month. Just go to the website. You can schedule yourself an appointment time and just mention that you saw our video. All right? Anything else? Baby liked it best when it moved. The baby moved? Okay. This baby's kicking her all day long. All right. You guys have an awesome day, and we will talk to you tomorrow.